a few people have wanted to see pictures um, or videos of the grill off of the Coney Island Thunderbolt and uh, here it is actually this headlight <laughs> does not belong to the grill that headlight belongs to this wrecked fender which used to belong to my Datsun 280ZX my beautiful car but that fender which used to go right there has been repaired fun car anyway um, a good friend of mine Kirk Ritchie and I went to Coney Island and it was right after they tore the Thunderbolt down and the trains were in the big pile of junk and wood in the field where Thunderbolt had just been demolished and we got permission to uh, actually rip this grill off of the front of one of the cars there were several grills several cars and we got that put it in the back of a of a minivan and drove it all the way back to Texas so that's the grill that was on the front of one of the cars of the Coney Island Thunderbolt that was built in the 1920s and the wheel is right here can't see it very good let me knock it over there there's a better view of it let me pull it it's very very heavy oh, I can barely move it <laughs> but I'm kinda weak old not really but it's really heavy and there's one wheel from the Coney Island Thunderbolt also that we tore off of one of the cars and it's still got parts of the car connected to it and uh, anyway there it is there's my kitty her name is kitty kitty because that's the first thing I ever said to her hi kitty kitty when I found her abandoned at work in the parking lot she's really an indoor cat but I let her outside only under my supervision once once or twice a day especially right now when she's in heat because I don't want or need any kittens and since you're probably wondering what this is this is a petard it's a cannon that uh, just makes noise you put you put water in this chamber and you do that by unscrewing that you put water in there then this stuff it's called bangsite it's calcium carbide and you put it's a powder chemical and you put a little bit of that calcium carbide in that little hole which this this acts as kind of like a spoon then you put that in there and when you screw it back tight it spills that little bit of calcium carbide in the water that's in there that's in that chamber and when calcium carbide and water mix together it makes acetylene gas then you screw this back on and put the flame of a lighter up to that little tiny hole and this cannon goes bang or boom <laughs> and if you get the mixture just right sometimes it's trial and error it can be really really loud it's a very cool very fun toy anyway that's it Coney Island Thunderbolt wheel from the 1920s Coney Island Thunderbolt front grill Dotson 280ZX and a petard actually I don't know if it's a petard it's a carbide cannon I don't think it's actually a petard anyway and if you build one of these you can get this bang site online or maybe there's a store near you but in Waco we don't have this kind of thing at almost any store or any store alright that's it thanks for watching and goodbye thanks for watching and goodbye